That was weird. I'll take it back. I thought you wanted to. What do you mean you can't it. take that back? You just force kissed me. No, no you're they not. No, they accused me of it the other day. Yes. They accused me of putting my thumb up someone. Okay, well, you get away from me. Oh my. <laughs> <laughs> what the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> what? 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 You don't talk about. Don't talk about. Don't drop my shit. I, I'll promise you, I'll shoot the shit. Put, let, let it go. Don't touch my shit. What a crazy proud day it must be for Kick today. Because today, not only one, but two crimes have been committed live. It is a personal record for Kick, and I truly hope the CEO of Kick actually takes the whole team out, have an outing, and thank the whole team for their efforts of bringing all these degenerate people and these criminals. <laughs> on the platform first streamer known as mr base who pushes himself into a woman wants to tickle them without their permission without their consent and the second streamer harassing a couple in public and once the couple were like stop filming us what are you doing what are you this is weird and they're like what did you say did, did you bluetooth bluetooth touch me and they take out a weapon and threaten to unalive everyone in the situation anyone walking by he was like i will shoot all of you even though it's a wonderful day at the kick headquarters it's not so much wonderful for the streamers the streamers the one with the pew pew he got arrested he's been banned and hopefully he will spend the rest of his days behind bar because the shit he just pulled out of his ass that gun on steroids not only it was super dangerous but it was also a very donkey move he's a danger to himself and to others i'm not going to talk about him in this video i'm going to save it for the next video that i'm going to post later on today because the other streamer i did my own investigation and holy shit it is deeper than i thought honestly i was very surprised of the things i found about him in the internet because he has been trending on the internet for the past decade and a half now before we go detective mode on this whole thing i'm going to show you the video which got him banned last night the video that went viral and everyone was like ew disgusting basically his community uh, told him gave him a challenge on go walk up to women and tell them kiss kiss my cheek and there will be donations coming in the chat and once the woman you know they're having a friendly conversation once the woman goes for the kiss on the cheek he goes kiss them on the whole lips now that shit used to work when you were 16 17 years old but not as a 56 year old man it's just weird it's creepy i ever got it if i get a kiss for that ah! you're bad no i didn't do it on purpose i was just oh, i thought you said that you went ah, I, I, how many times have people try to pull that trick off and fail never it has never happened in my entire no one's life. ever even tried never, that never ever in my life oh most people fail at that no trick. because i knocked and we got out. a nice soft kiss out of it right what no they sub, they, I get 10 subs if, if I come by and You can't just like force people to kiss you for money. No, it was, it was a joke. It's not a joke. It's weird. Do you want me to buy you drinks or not? No. I'll take it back. I thought you wanted What do you mean you can't take that back? You just force kissed me. Oh, Jesus. I'm the wrong guy to say that to. No, no you're they not. No, they accused me of it the other day. Yes. They accused me of putting my thumb up someone's ass. Okay, well, me, when I first watched the whole clip, I was like, okay, that's weird. An old ass man uh, doing a trick that a 15 year old does. It was just creepy. I was like, okay, it's just a normal day at the kick platform. Someone just browsing and seeing an old man doing these kind of moves. And the woman felt violated in that situation. But at the same time, I was like, why would she even go for a kiss on the cheek in the first place? It. I didn't really think much of it. I was like, okay, it's just a normal day at kick. But then something went, came and started tickling my ass hair. It, it's my body started to get the itch of being nosy and do my own investigation go on a full detective mode and see what i can find online about this guy and i gotta tell you that itch was worth it so it turned out it wasn't his first time getting banned last night he actually got banned last week from kick as well for going on a full tickle mode it was one step away from turning from a streaming platform into a corn hub but the illegal type, the black market type. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> what the fuck? My lips on your fucking yeah, sound drill. Yeah. Fucking yeah. Fucking <laughs> what the fuck? Wait, bro, you're about to get canceled. <laughs> what the fuck are you doing, dude? Oh my god. Oh, wow. my god. Wait, 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 don't film oh that. My god. The Groper. Hey, hey. Oh my god. Stop. I would never touch her. You put your finger up my ass. Oh, I know, but that doesn't count. Bro woke up and he had one plan and one plan only in his mind get banned on kick. And to give you a little bit of context about this, this woman you can see is Kimberly Lee. 
She's a corn star. She's an adult star. So this donkey thought just because she does shakalaka boom boom on camera, she is up for anything and she is a piece of object. So let me go tickle that object so my whole stream chat will have a good laugh about it. And obviously the people who watch this donkey did have a good time, did have a laugh about it. But unfortunately the people on the internet or anyone with a decency even as one percent of decency in their brain knew that this whole thing was not okay it was an absolutely disgusting act for someone to do to a woman adult star or not so the people started giving backlash and kicks all the backlash and they were like okay well don't worry guys we're going to ban this person and surprise surprise after 24 hours he was unbanned and was doing the same thing all over again kick is literally like when your dad is forced to punish you, when you piss off your mom and your mom wants to see you punished, but she doesn't want to punish you, she wants your dad to punish you. And the dad doesn't really give a shit, but he decides to punish you anyways, because if he doesn't, he's not going to get a Gaga 6,000 the next six months. No, that was disgusting. Absolutely unacceptable. You are a disgusting human being. Don't worry, I'll see you tomorrow. But even after I found this disgusting animal doing this disgusting things, the itch was still itching. I was like, there is more to this donkey. Honestly, I need to stop calling him a donkey because I have more respect for a donkey. So I decided to look further. And I found out Bro is actually the final boss of Kick. Because in 2012, he pleaded guilty to promoting prostitution, criminal sale of controlled substances, and money laundering. And leaving aside the fact that Bro was a drug dealer, a money launderer, all this criminal stuff. One funny thing I found is... Bro was a straight up pimp, and you know what he called himself? The king of all pimps. Jason Itzler ran arguably New York's biggest high-priced prostitution ring called New York Confidential. Fresh out of jail just seven months. This is what happens when you allow anything to happen on your platform. Guys, go be free. Do whatever you want. We at Kick believe in freedom. Fucking criminals are going to come into your platform. Now, his record is pretty public. It's actually everywhere. And he is obsessed with getting on news for the degenerate stuff that he does. So when Kick came and said, guys, streaming platform, everyone free to do whatever they want. Bro saw a golden opportunity and it was his time to shine. He didn't hesitate about anything. He took the first chance and got on the platform. He went for it and just sealed the deal with Kick. The government took five million from me and, and the government's going to give it the no, they're not. They're well, not. I've already made a lot of money off of this. You're a nice, a nice You're Jewish man. It's cold entertainment. I know. By the view, like but you don't have to. Yeah. You, yeah. you could clean it, clean it up. You could clean it up and make She's your way really back cute. in. I'm repenting. You could totally make your way back I don't sell in. sex. I sell love. You can clean up your act. You know what? Give me your number and we'll I talk about cleaning that. up my oh. act. Bro is addicted to that cloud because two decades ago in 2004, this video was released and people told him, you can clean up your act. Like you, you don't need to be this degenerate. I didn't show you this, but in this video, he was actually showing a shakalaka boom boom tape of himself proudly showcasing it for everyone to see because it was gonna get him famous. And people were like, why are you doing this? You don't need to do this. You can clean up your act. You can clean up your image. They try to give him advice, but they didn't know that this is what he was born to be. This is this was his true destiny. So he stood tall, had a smile on his face, and was showing a schmex tape of himself to everyone. To us, he might be a pathetic loser, but to the kick community, he's an absolute hero. A true legend. They're going to write stories about him after his death. But the streamers are kick are not a big fan of him because he took the title and he made it impossible for anyone to compete for the title of being the final boss of kick, the champion of of kick the next person going for the title really gotta do something extremely disgusting to be able to even compete compete with them but it's up to the kick community to decide who is the true champion but in my eyes he's the final boss of kick there's no updates of him getting arrested he probably will with the future acts that he's going to be doing overall another degenerate kick streamer but this one had an interesting twist to it it was added with some extra flavors of disgusting 100 percent, he needs to get arrested and ladies if you are ever in new york and you see this donkey walking towards you run run J just run just know that if you do not run your ears are going to get fingered for the price of 15 subs and for those of you who are still watching the video it would truly help out the channel and the community if you leave a like leave a subscribe let me know your thoughts in the comments below take care of yourself i'll catch you at the next one